Hello, Scorpio. Amy Energy here with your weekly tarot message. If you have not, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell to be notified whenever I make a new video. All right, working with the next world tarot, my favorite deck, pulling out our career, love life, and personal. All right, keep in mind this reading may not resonate for every Scorpio placement out there, so it is a general reading. Feel free to check out um, your other placements. I do these for all 12 zodiac signs. And you can also book a personal with me, and that link is in the description box. Okay, getting into career. Wow, Scorpio, a major transformation is happening this week in our career, okay? Yes, through our relationships with others. I definitely feel like this week, Scorpio, we are... You know, doing something new here with the Page of Pentacles, we are, you know, trying out a new course of action. And so we might be really feeling like a beginner, right? However, I do feel like we are connecting with others and they're really able to see us. And despite if we aren't, you know, we might be feeling with the page of pentacles i do feel like we might be feeling like you know i want to say imposter syndrome although that's not quite but you know we're feeling like we're a newbie like we don't maybe have the right terminology or we don't have enough to offer in whatever we're doing in our career however the people we're connecting with they see us they really do so they're able to see that, you know, maybe they're able to recognize that you're a beginner, but they recognize also that what you have right now is valuable because pentacles are really long lasting value, right? So the people you're connecting with can see that. And I do feel like the connections are, you know, it's really beautiful. And I do feel like with the death card coming out, you know something had to fall away like we really had to let go of an outdated way of being in order to open up this opportunity so it's it's really transformational this week and it really has a lot to do with our connection to others and recognizing how important that is okay let's get into love life yes See, our love life and our career are overlapping here, right? Because in our love life, we have the three of pentacles. So I feel like we're networking, right? This is the team, Mars in Capricorn. And this is, you know, a card with great communication, people who love working together. Okay, wow. I love that this emperor is on the bottom of the deck deck we are building scorpio you're really building something here and with the two of cups and the queen of cups i do feel like in our love life it's there's a lot of true love here right equal give and take people who truly love us and we're feeling like we have a lot of love to give and we're also very receptive of love okay so I definitely love this and we have this um, four of wands and the emperor on the bottom of the deck so with these fours I do feel like we're definitely building right we're getting that fourth leg on our table so that we can put stuff on top of it and it's stable right we, we are really just taking the initiative to to build and with the four of wands that's the energy of harmony and that's what's over this reading so all the work we're doing this week it's not only working for us but it, it feels really good okay now personal we have the four of pentacles okay another four so <laughs> really beautiful okay but this is and the emperor coming out again with judgment wow scorpio so we are feeling 
Look at this. The Wheel of Fortune on the bottom of the deck, Scorpio. You are making things happen this week, right? Just by your openness and your willingness and your desire, you're just really getting these wheels turning. And with this judgment, you are having an awakening. There is something deep within you that is calling you, you know, to your calling to your destiny to your purpose so this is very powerful okay this major arcana coming out i do feel like you know it's helping us to to get the stability that we need to build what we want to build okay with the four of pentacles i definitely feel like we're making the most of what we have right we're we're really assessing the situation and saying these are the tools that i have and i'm utilizing every tool i have to get what i want to build my empire and it's a beautiful thing and you got the wheel of fortune so the universe is working with you as you're making these moves you're making that wheel turn and the opportunities are going to come it's absolutely beautiful scorpio a wonderful a wonderful week. A wonderful week for you, Scorpio. Getting us an oracle from the Sacred Destiny Oracle. Release. Yes, we're definitely releasing. Okay, because we got that death. Death is the first card in our reading. So we definitely are releasing. Let's see here. Autumn light. The sacred landscape wants you to know. When you receive this card, it's time to let go and surrender. Let go of situations, people, and objects that do not serve you. Let go of old, outmoded, self-limiting beliefs that drag you down. This is a time of stripping away superficial distractions until you reach who you are at your core. If you are holding on to the old, it is difficult for anything new to come into your life. Begin to clear your home and living environments of clutter. If you don't love it or use it, it is probably clutter. Clear it out of your space. It's time for a detox. Get ready for the new Oh, sorry. To get ready for the new, you must release the old. All right, Scorpio, I am going to leave it there. A beautiful reading. If you enjoyed this reading, if you appreciate the work I'm doing with this channel, like the video, comment, and share this channel with a friend. It really makes a huge difference, so I appreciate it so much with all my heart. Okay, um, what else? Follow me on Instagram at Amy Energy. Book a personal with me in the description box. I would love to connect with you, so definitely feel free to contact me. Any of that, all the information you need in the description box. But most importantly, have a wonderful week. I love you. Take care.